What's going on long wing bald ducks? We got another one here for you today. Today we're out on the Kettle River in Sandstone, Minnesota. We're going down from Sandstone, Minnesota, just south of Ban uh, Banning State Park. Yeah, I think it's a state park, not a state forest or anything. But, uh, and then we're gonna go down to Governor Knowles uh, on the St. Croix. So, Kettle River to the St. Croix. Uh, something cool about the Kettle River is uh, in certain pools it gets up to 100 feet deep. That's pretty deep for one of those fingerling rivers that go into a main river. So, yeah, tonight's goal is just to get down the river, find a place to sleep. We're gonna wake up tomorrow and uh, push another like 20 miles. So, uh, we got a lot of we got a lot of ground to get down, a lot of miles to put on. A lot of river to cover, so let's get to it. Woo! Oh, try not to lose the kayak either. That kind of suck. Oh, yep. So we're getting out because these rapids, right there, pretty nuts. And we're just in like $200 kayaks, and it's the beginning of the season. And I don't want to get wet because we're five minutes into the trip. Yeah, here we got a good island, lots of firewood. There's a cool point over there, but we gotta keep moving. We can't just do a quarter mile. There's gonna be a lot of places that look like good camping. It's beautiful though. A lot of mosquitoes already. I like three in my ear. You haven't gotten any? Oh. I got you, babe. I'll take the mosquitoes for you. Yeah, we're kind of in a channel right now. The main river's over there. It's kind of nice. Still cruising though, like three miles an hour, two, two and a half. Easy. Paddling, probably close to, probably close to like five, six miles an hour paddling. Shit, that might be a full out sprint. We might be going at eight. Good, good 75% sprint. I don't know what that sound is. It's like he's saying meep. Meep. Yeah, so we're like 20 minutes in. Oh, no, we're not. That's a stupid like 40 minutes in 45 minutes in it's starting to get a little dark but uh, we got headlamps and everything so i think we're just gonna cruise into the dark here a little bit do a little bit of a night paddle um set up camp real quick maybe have a little bit of a fire and go to bed it's moving we're putting in a lot putting on a lot of miles so i don't think we're gonna have to work too hard tomorrow uh yeah Hope you're enjoying the adventure, I sure am. This is nice. After all that snow and everything, you just wanna get outside and have a little bit of adventure. And this is a good good first river adventure for the year. So yeah, enjoy the B-roll. Some of them Canadian ducks. I mean, it went for dumb. I'm back across the river. Didn't really have any firewood on that island, so I'm gonna check out over here and see if this is a better spot. Oh, it's beautiful out. What do you think it is? Like 48 degrees out right now? I'm gonna say it's 48. I feel pretty confident about that specific number. 
48, four mile an hour wind. There is a nip, but it's going to be nice with a fire. Yeah. Oh yeah, that's nice. Flat. Looks good. We we got pretty lucky though. We got a nice night. Mm -hmm. It could be windy, rainy. It was supposed to rain, but actually, I think it was tomorrow more. Today was like 30%. Tomorrow's like 86. So we'll get a little rain. You sound like a loon. But, yeah. Well, got a fire going, hanging out, <clears throat> didn't get any fishing, but just going to let this burn out and go to bed, so see you when the sun comes up. Alright, that was our camp, there's our little dry spot, we're just getting out on the water today, going to have a pretty good day, it was pouring out this morning, alright, you got the babe in the water. I'm gonna get in the water and we're gonna paddle because there's an opening. We got a north wind. We're heading south. There's an opening where it's not raining. So we're gonna try to stay in that opening so we don't get dumped on all day because there's a 100% chance of rain. That's pretty high odd. So we're gonna get moving. We're gonna throw some B-roll down. Try to see some beavers. Try to see some deer. Try to see some Canadian ducks. Try to see some uh, the green mallard American ducks. I think they're American. We're in America. So yeah, catch you in a little bit. This is where we came in last night. Had our own private little dock. Probably help if your paddles are upside down. Both of ours were. We'll flip it. Like, put the one on your right hand into your left hand. Oh. So you got the scoops. There you go. There's a little tin boat up there. Let's get out onto the river. So we're gonna make our way. It's up to 25% now, battery. This thing is messed up. We're gonna make our way down the river. There's a bridge down there. If it starts pouring, might call it just because we weren't really ready for this but we're gonna push on and try to make it the whole way i think we might be able to make it the whole way i really want to make it the whole way i don't want to i don't want to back out oh it's at 35 percent now maybe it just likes listening to me talk all right look at this b-roll that's some good b-roll Pretty messed up over here. I think I'm gonna hook across the river and try to get to the other side. It looks a lot more chill. And it's about to rain. Oh shit, that's not cool. That is not cool. I'm gonna try to throw this, this bag over my legs because. Fuck, there you go. Unhook, please. Unhook. She's going to try to get out. Come on, babe. Go for gold. Just jump out. You got it, baby. Woo! Oh, man. That's a girl right there. That's the kind of girl you want to marry. But try to get out of here so my pole doesn't get stuck I'll pull over over here for her. Whew. yeah she got flipped around quick moving too fast I was gonna flip I think I got an opening up here right here oh yeah 
power through it, power through it. Oh yeah, we're out. Woo! God, go help her out. Are you good? You're good? Okay. It's better up here. I'm just gonna go help her. Okay, she's back in the water, going good. Oh, I'm pretty wet. This is a fun one. Oh yeah, this is a real fun one. Whoop, whoop, whoop. I wonder if this thing's even recording right now. Oh, it is. 15%. Yeah, it's a pretty good day. Just cruising down the river in your underwear. What do you do? That's life, dude. That's living. Oh, yeah. It's beautiful out. I mean, check this. Nice, like, game trail right on the edge of the river. Game trail is everywhere because there's beavers. Beavers just sliding around making you nice walking paths everywhere. Super nice. Oh. Oh, all right, let's get back to those rapids. Sending it. Let's send it. Oh. Yeah. Oh. Okay, we're gonna shoot right close to the shore here. Oh, or not. Yeah, right here. Perfect. Right here. Kind of hard right, hard right. Stay close to the shore. Woo! Oh, shit. Oh. You don't want to get sucked into that. That's a bad day. That's a really bad day if you get sucked into that. Oh, fishing pole. Oh. Uh oh. We're getting sucked into it. Oh. Oh. Yeah, if you shot that gap, it was fine. But you easily could have gotten sucked into the into the shit. Yeah, yup, you just gotta stay straight and paddle hard and you make it through. Ah, oh, it's freaking raining again. Coming off of like a point and it shoves you into like the shit. Like if you, if you go with it and don't paddle through it, you're screwed and you know that. But you never know if you can paddle through it until you paddle through it. So, all right, it's a little bit of a rush. Not like we're pro kayakers. I mean, when you're rocking a Coleman, it means you're a noob. And we're noobs to kayaking. But I'd say we're like a level two or three noob. We could get up, we could get up into the novice level here pretty soon. Oh, it's wet. We're gonna get to camp, put that tarp up, make a fire and dry out. Hopefully we can get a good fire started, but a lot of this wood is pretty wet, but the inside of it isn't, so should be able to get something pretty good going. Battery, but we made it to the bridge. We're gonna call it. We, I don't think we can get it to our destination tonight. Just too much rain. It's just been downpouring for a pretty long time, and uh, yeah, there, this is the last piece of road going across the river until our destination which is probably another day and a half paddle we don't have that <clears throat> pretty pretty wet so it's gonna call it right here see you when we get to shore well made it to the bridge just gonna start a little fire here and chill i uh, made about a third of the way of what we wanted to but man it's just downpouring absolutely downpouring out right now um paddled for about five hours and got to the bridge and we're gonna call it uh, i don't think we'd get all the way to our destination by tomorrow afternoon because we, we'd have to throw a tarp up right now build a fire um dry all our stuff out and then it wouldn't even be worth probably getting back on the river because be getting late so we're gonna call it here Pretty good adventure. Kettle River is super dope. Uh, definitely gonna be coming back here. Lots of cool islands. Saw like 30 long wing bald ducks, bunch of beavers, no deer. Uh, lots of those mallard ducks. So 
pretty good adventure overall. We're just waiting to get picked up under this bridge. Got all of our stuff just sprawled out. Kelsey's gonna start a fire. We're gonna sit by it and chill and wait to get picked up. So hope you, hopefully you enjoyed the adventure. I know I sure did. I know Kelsey sure did. Um, we're gonna check you next time. See ya.